Here's defense grip base. This blade base is awesome for defense. The tip is sharp but made of rubber. Usually when a Bailey gets hit it slides, but this grips the stadium floor and just hops. If your rubber tip is worn down, like this one, I think the previous owner used it on a rough surface. You could just pop it out and flip it. Doing this will make it an attack type. It'll be fast as grip attacker but taller. I read this is legal. Just a little helpful tip. No pun intended. Having a sharp rubber tip doesn't really help with endurance. But defense type Beyblades aren't known for their endurance. Here's the right spin gear. Nothing special besides being blue. This is the whale attacker, attack ring. It has two whales on the design. The whales are the contact points. I'm not sure why this design is chosen for defense. Because this attack ring has a lot of recoil. Usually when an opponent attacks Seaborg, either it ends up being knocked out or a big draw. <laughs> That's if it doesn't break. The assembly is pretty easy, besides assembling the spin gear. Here's the 8 wide weight disc. Wide weight discs have their weight spread out. I'm not sure why this is chosen for Seaborg. A balanced or heavy weight disc would help with endurance, which Seaborg needs. Seaborg is an awesome Beyblade. It has probably the best defense, but it seems to be falling into obscurity. I don't see much videos of it. If you want this Beyblade for battling, I suggest getting multiple Beyblades. The attack ring can break and the tip will wear down. If that happens, just flip the rubber tip. Just keep an eye out on eBay. This Beyblade shouldn't be too hard to find. 